Hey, what is happening everybody? What's going on? Happy Friday. Hopefully everybody is having a much better week. I know you're getting rest because of everything that's going on. Um, be safe. But you know what, Honda? Oh boy, do I love you so. And uh, yeah, they're having a baby. Yeah, we're gonna talk about it next on The Rant and Ride. Hey, what is up? What's going on, everybody? Happy Friday. Hopefully things are getting better on your side of the planet. It's getting a lot better here, uh, at least where I live in Texas. And uh, hopefully everybody's being safe, being precautious, and uh, taking care of themselves and their loved ones. So uh, this is not about, this is hopefully to take your mind off. So just sit around, take the five to eight minutes and, you know, and, uh, uh, listen to the rant ride and hopefully it'll take away a little bit of what's going on out in the in the real world anyway um first things first hey you know what i've got a great little buddy out there um he's he's like my own um his name is oliver and he has this brand new youtube channel he's just trying to get started oliver or it's going to be down in the description and i'm going to try to put it on screen for you guys man go give that little guy a sub he loves motorcycles and uh, not only does he love motorcycles, he loves gaming. And uh, even if you're not a gamer, man, go hook him up, man. He's just a little young guy trying to, to have a little fun and, and get started. So he sure would appreciate it. And it would really be awesome to me if you guys would help him out. Anyway, if this is your first time, thumbs up, man. Hit that subscribe, please. And be part of the channel. Don't forget our website, 69080b.com. Make sure that you're part of it. That way you are registered and you're in. Don't forget the bell. That way you know of new stuff that's coming up and you can be notified whenever we get all of our stuff going. Anyway, on to the rant and ride. I know the opening takes a few seconds, man, but just bear with me a little bit. Honda. You know, I love all motorcycles. I don't have a favoritism just because I have a KTM. I have a Honda in the garage, too, and I love Honda. Honda makes really fantastic motorcycles, and you know they're having a baby. <laughs> At least that's the rumor. I found some really good information. I know there's some other stuff out there, but Honda rumored, um, and it's pretty credible, that they are in the midst of making a new mid-adventure bike that I think, man, in all honesty, is going to be a huge competitor in the market. Yes, a 790 Africa Twin. Three models is what they're talking about. How freaking cool would that be? For all you Honda guys that are out there, if you know anything about this or if you got any data or information, down in the comments, please let other people know uh, what you know, and that way we can uh, get more information to everybody that's out there. So. I think it's really pretty cool um you know because they did the 1000 and then they updated it to the 1100 with a bunch of new stuff and made that bike a lot more right but their biggest problem is is they don't really have a midweight and they talked about that 850 that had tons of buzz but we still haven't seen it <laughs> and but this one is highly credible um one of the main guys from honda manufacturing they're really trying to dig in and get into the adventure side of motorcycling and not just that but they really want to get the new guys and they want the experienced guys so they're going to make three models out of this bike uh, a 790 and it's going to be based around the nc line of motorcycles the 750s and the 750x and basically they're going to take that basic platform and build it into a 790 okay and it's not going to have all the horsepower that you know the 1100 you know and the uh, thousand and all that stuff it's it, that's not what it's meant to be but what they are going to do is they're going to build a really good solid platform and it's built around the dollar the dollar amount 
that are really focusing on trying to build a really good adventure bike that's not going to cost an arm and a leg. And if they can achieve that, that's going to be really, really cool and fantastic for a lot of people and make it affordable for just about everybody to get into it. And with the lower horsepower, that's going to make it really pretty cool for everybody. It's not going to be too overpowered, but it's not going to be too underpowered at 790 cc's. It's going to be good for all riders, which is really, really good. New and experienced riders. And I think with if they can get the numbers right, man, they'll splash it, man. They'll, they will literally take the middle market, especially with that 700 that's out there from Yamaha and the 790 from KTM. And you got the 850 from, you know, BMW and all that stuff. But I think Honda, with making it a price first motorcycle, we're not going to get quite the farkles that we're used to having. They're probably not going to have an adjustable suspension. It's probably not going to have an adjustable windscreen. And some of the added extra features that we normally get on the more expensive venture bikes. But at the end of the day, do we really need all that stuff? <laughs> and all honesty, I don't think we do. And I think really it comes down to Bryce. And if we can get a really good adventure bike for not having to break the bank, I think they'll sell a ton of them. What do you think? Put it down below in the comments. I'd be interested to hear what you guys think about that type of bike come into the market. And do you know anything about it? And if you do, down below, please. I sure would appreciate it. It's going to come in the standard and the DCT gearbox. So it's going to have that automatic type transmission. Plus, you're going to be able to get the standard transmission so you can shift your gears and do all your stuff. But I think overall, a 790 Africa Twin, and if they can get the weight down and they can turn that into a nice, inexpensive adventure bike, man, I think that's a home run. It's very, very cool. I am slowly getting into the market for an adventure motorcycle, and I just don't know what I want. And we're getting lots of choices. <laughs> so to me, it's really pretty fantastic, pretty cool. Um, there's a few bikes I got my eyes on, and uh, this one I'm definitely going to have my eye on. And rumored is that in September, we're probably going to hear about this bike. What do you think? Do you think it would be a hit? What do you think they need to do to make it to where it actually will take off and compete in the marketplace with that 700 and that 790 from KTM and Yamaha? I think those are the two big boys in the marketplace right now. I don't know. We'll see. If anybody can do it, Honda can. Hey, give it up to them, man. They won the Dakar Rally, man. They took the crown away from KTM. So, uh, you know, and it didn't take them very long to do it. So if anybody can do it, it's definitely going to be Yama, I mean, uh, um, Honda. So, without further ado, you guys have a fantastic weekend, and be safe out there, and uh, yeah, do your best, man. Try to take your mind off that virus a little bit, and it's what you can. Uh, don't take it light, but also, you know what? You got to live a little, too. I'm Joe, 690 v Thanks for stopping in. Thanks for being part of it. Don't forget, go to Oliver Orr on YouTube. Give that little guy a sub, man. You'll make his day, man. I promise you, you will make his day. And I just think it's awesome, and you guys are fantastic. Without anything else, go out and ride. Because if you want social distancing, guess what? <laughs> you can't get more social distancing than riding your motorcycle. I'm Joe, 690 v Thank you so much. Don't forget. Hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and be part of the channel, and we appreciate you. And we'll see you next Friday, man. Be safe. 690 out.